So everyone's always talking about CinemaScope this, VistaVision that, vertical video, square, 2 to 1, 3 by 4, 4 by 3. But you know what? I say, forget all that. It's time to shoot circular. Anyway, jokes aside, this is a really fun setup here. This is the Canon 8 to 64 zoom for the Super 16 format. Uh, it's a very popular lens to use anytime you're shooting 16 millimeter and need a run and gun style zoom. It's very small uh, and lightweight, so it's perfect for documentary style shooting. Uh, it's well known for being the main lens used to shoot the Hurt Locker, which is an incredibly shot film, all 16 millimeter. Uh, but yeah, it's a really fun look uh, when you put it on a full frame sensor, which is what I'm doing here. And as you can see, when you're filming with direct hard light entering the lens, uh, it's bouncing all around in there and you can see the inside of the lens itself uh, and all the different glass elements and there's these really interesting rainbow effects and reflections and flares going on. Um, it's a really fun look. Uh, and then also when you zoom, you can see those glass elements moving. Everything is changing inside the lens, which is also a super interesting effect. So that's something to experiment with for sure. Um, this was just some footage that I was speeding on for fun between scenes while filming some quick shots downtown uh, on a commercial project. Uh, here I am showing the full range of the zoom. This is the 8mm end, and then here's the 64. Uh, I didn't have any ND on the lens, because uh, you could see the map box on the wide end. So all this footage is very stopped down, probably an 11 or 16. Um, but yeah, it's, it's super fun uh, messing around with this look. Um, and it's cool to have this circular wide angle look, but not on a fisheye lens. So yeah, this was just me experimenting and finding some interesting new looks. Uh, maybe I'll bring this up to some directors uh, for a future music video or something. <laughs>